My expectations um, on this conference are to really learn from country experience and from our projects in different countries here in Africa, because uh, us at the sector project, we work on a daily basis with BMZ. We know about their international priorities, particularly as regards biodiversity and agriculture and the topic of agroecology. But we want to feel um, what the countries are discussing with their partners and also implement. So I'm looking forward to learning from their experiences. One specific area I'm interested here to learn more about and to hear experiences is on agroecology, because we are on this conference, we are working on transformation of agri um, food systems towards sustainability. Um, and we feel that there's not so many pathways so far how this transformation can look like. So agroecology is a recent movement. Germany with BMZ and BML, the Ministry for Economic Cooperation and the Ministry for Agriculture have just joined a coalition on agroecology. So we want to discuss with the colleagues here from the different partner countries if they are also working on it or if they are more interested in working on this topic. Uh, I think uh, regarding my takeaway messages so far from the discuss discussions I heard, it is very important to further improve knowledge sharing and knowledge management because uh, very often uh, our colleagues working in the projects are not so aware of all the discussions that we are having at headquarters and also not the services that we can provide, such as trainings or also uh, some consultancies on topics, on innovative topics. So um, this is what I'm taking uh, home with me, that uh, we should exchange more on the innovative topics and how we can collaborate on them. Uh, when I look at the discussions on transformation taking place here, I, I'm really happy to see that there's a lot of discussion on transformation and climate change. But what I feel is missing still a little bit from the discussion is on biodiversity. How is biodiversity and the protection of our natural resources linked to the transformation? Because in the end of the day, if we lose our natural base, we will not be able to produce food. Um, this is an upcoming issue at the headquarters, and I think it will be interesting Interesting to discuss this with our partner countries, also in the context of integrated approaches, how we can um, work together with the climate, the food and the biodiversity community towards the global goals and towards the country goals. If I had the power to put money in a certain area, uh, I really believe that there is a lot of potential to work on uh, working with nature and not against nature in agriculture. That we can, uh, there's a lot of knowledge out there, also traditional knowledge, and we can invest in innovation and nature-based solutions at the same time. Agroecology is one of these approaches. Regenerative agriculture is one of these approaches. We need to regenerate our soils. We need to regenerate the services nature provides to us because otherwise we won't be able to produce food on a long-term basis.